Welcome back to London Hughes' News Thing, or Hughes Thing. Come on, guys, please change the titles to Hughes Thing. Now, this week, the people of South London's Hither Green have been mourning the death of a man who had the misfortune to try and burgle the house of Britain's hardest pensioner. This unsuspecting burglar had broken into the old man's house, hoping to find what all old people hoard, cash, jewellery, stale biscuits, copies of Chat Magazine and increasingly racist views. The pensioner whose house it was was 78-year-old Richard Osborne Brooks, middle class, obviously, was initially held on suspicion of murder, but was quickly released with no further action. But just a couple of days later, floral tributes to the dead burglar started to appear on the fence outside his home. And as soon as they appeared, they started getting taken down again, like this. This man didn't know anyone involved, but still tore down flowers and tributes, which he saw as an insult to the homeowner. He's a hero. Why shouldn't he come back and live in his property? What, the police can't protect him? How disgraceful is that? OK, flowers haven't been this controversial since Jamelia went on loose women without a poppy. I mean, why do you hate Britain, Jamelia? Why? <laughs> the Met's deputy commissioner called it a tragedy for the family of the burglar and a tragedy for the homeowner. But the biggest tragedy is for all the local men who've forgotten their wedding anniversary and found the petrol stations run out of emergency flowers. Happy anniversary, darling. Here's some screen wash and a Jinster's cheese and onion slice. So basically, people are coming out as Team OAP or Team Burglar. On Team OAP, we've got John Bishop, who has called the police's plea for respect at the shrine. Disgusting. Unusual for a liver puddy not to take the side of a burglar. Hmm. And on Team Burglar, there's me. <laughs> Yeah, that's right, I'm Team Burglar. I mean, he's a dead man, let him live. The police have assigned 24-hour protection to the shrine, with mounted officers patrolling the street. Is this really the best use of our police resources? I mean, we've got a knife crime crisis, people, and the police are stuck guarding some dahlias. Of course, those tributes would have stayed on the fence longer if they'd been fixed to the fence properly, but hey, they probably can't find a screwdriver. So, panel, are you team OAP or team burglar? It's like team Jen or team Angelina, but what come? Definitely team burglar. I am a, I am a wishy-washy member of the liberal elite. Nice. And I'm not really into killing people yet. If someone came into my house, I'd go at them with a tool. Yes? Yeah, fuck them. you go at them? I'd go at them with a tool. Would you kill someone? If I accidentally kill... This is... I'm not going to... <laughs> That leads me to my next question. <laughs> Panel, have any of you ever accidentally killed someone or killed someone? <laughs> no. No? I'll Maybe. tell you, I haven't killed someone, but I might kill someone if I come across one, another one of these soggy shrines on the street. So yeah. you... Because I have had it with... They just look like a big, soggy heap of rubbish. So you don't like... The, they're dead people. Yeah, but the last thing I need is another heap of rubbish. We've already got whales. I'm done. I am done. <laughs> so, David, what do you mean to say is, if a member of your family died, you wouldn't want to put flowers in the area that they died? Not, not, not in England. Yeah. A different story if you're in Italy or Spain or something. Here, you want a soggy heap of rubbish? Go to an art gallery. Otherwise, yeah. Not interested. So you don't mind people ripping down all these flowers? <laughs> Rip them all yeah. down. Really? Yes. Oh, yes. Well, my point of view was, look, he's a burglar. It's better than cyber. He's got out. There's people in basements, like, trying to steal your identity. You know, not But he's a boring. dead person. He is dead. That's why I said, I, I, I don't know about the, all the flowers, but I do think people have to respect the fact that he might have been robbing that old man because that old man disrespected him. You don't, don't know. know. Next question, guys. How would you like to be remembered? David? I want a proper uh, tombstone in a proper cemetery. That's where you deserve a tribute. You know Ooh, what I mean? Isn't it dull? <laughs> no, it's fabulous. Yeah, it's so fabulous. So just a normal way then? It's well, a casual way that Yeah, but knows. you can't get into cemeteries anymore. You've got to know someone. Oh, really? Oh, you know? yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. True. yeah oh, really? Absolutely. Is it like a member's club? It's like getting a council totally. flat. Is that what you mean? Are you serious? Yeah. Is it like getting a doctor's appointment in London? Yeah. yeah. Really? Yeah.